If you have PCOS and you were told to avoid evening primrose oil, that advice is very incomplete. So a student of mine in my community today actually told me that she's had multiple health professionals warn her that evening primrose oil would make her PCOS worse. And I hear this all the time because apparently in medicine, we like to blame the firemen for the fire. Now PCOS isn't a hormone problem. It is an insulin signaling and timing problem. And evening primrose oil does increase signaling at the membrane level. And if insulin signaling is chaotic, if you're not ovulating, if your circadian rhythm is off, then any increase in signaling can make you feel much worse. Not because evening primrose oil is bad, but because the system isn't ready to use the signal. So when your biology lacks coherence, we don't need more signals. We don't need more supplements. We need stability. And the real question in PCOS isn't what supplement should I take or not take? It's what am I doing to support my biology's ability to signal properly? And when insulin, light, timing, and membranes come first, the things that we once blamed often become the very things that can help us.